right? So to to remove the actual toilet seat, you press these two clips, bring it up. You've got these two clips. Just help yourself with the standing knife to raise it slightly, and then you can insert a small screwdriver. One off. off and then what you do you pull one inch you pull the other inch and then so the seat can come off now I would advise you not to remove them because firstly they're dismantling too and then you'll you'll struggle to find the right position because there is um, uh, it's like teeth basically we keep them in place and then you take, uh, I think it's a 5mm Allen key and then you can unscrew to make it as, uh, you know, faster or you can screw it to make it slower. So um, after a few years those hinges tend to uh, lose some slowdowns so they tend to drop. Uh, you've got some adjustment and you can just screw to slow it down. Once it's done, you can put half a turn, you put it back, clip it back, put it back in place. See what I was saying? The, the teeth need to be aligned, that's back in place. Um, I would not put the clip first, what I would do, I try first. And then, if you're happy with the slowdown, like that's quite. Uh, the right speed for me. Then I will to put the clip. That's it.